Rails 3, we had something called Attribute Accessible, which would be a whitelist of the different attributes within our model. However, with Rails 4 and the introduction of strong params, this is no longer necessary. So within Rails 4, the only way you're going to be able to check to see what attributes make up a model is to check out the schema.rb under your DB folder or check the migrations. Otherwise, you really don't have a great way to see your structural layout of each model. This is where the annotate models gem comes into play. We can use this gem to generate our model descriptions, the attributes within the actual model file, as a commented outline at the top. It can also be used to generate the implicit paths in our routes file as well. While we could use the annotate gem outside of the Rails application, just having it installed, not necessarily adding it to our gem file, it does offer a benefit as we can run a generator, which will create a task so whenever we run RakeDB Migrate, it will automatically annotate those models. To annotate our model, we'll simply just type annotate, and then we'll exclude the test fixtures, factories, and serializers to just annotate the model. So once we do this, it'll run the generator, and then we can check out our user model. We'll now see a table with the different attributes for that table. Annotate's also helpful for generating our routes documentation. So here we can run annotate routes, and if we look back in our routes file now, once it generates, you'll see that it gives you the prefix, the verb, the URI, and what controller and action it will be hitting. So I have just removed the user migration, just running a rate DB rollback and deleting the annotated information in my user model. So now let's generate the installer just by writing rails g annotate install. And this will create a file. So now when we run our rake db migrate, it'll run through the migrations and you'll see that now it has annotated the model. And to delete your annotations from your models, you can just type annotate double dash delete. This will go through and delete all your annotations from the models. You can also do the same thing with your routes if you need to, just by typing or adding in the dash dash routes and it'll go through your routes and it'll delete them as well. Well, that's all for this episode. Thank you for watching.